there's a lot that my parents and Steve don't even know. They all think that I've been sober. The fact of the matter is, is that I have been drinking. Just yesterday, I probably had 10 drinks. Even today, I had two tequilas and a bottle of wine. In my parents' house, I know they have a no drinking rule, but you know, I drink at their home all the time. I use my parents' car to go buy alcohol. I have this great Todd's purse that I can hide the liquor in. Sometimes I have to drape a sweater over it so they can't see that it's bulging. What I do is I close the bedroom door and go in and I drink. When I'm drinking, I have to hide the bottle behind pillows. After I finish a beer at my parents' house, I'll take the bottle and hide it in a suitcase I have in my closet. This is where I'm hiding my bottles. If my parents find it, they're gonna take them out. I also have two adult children from a previous relationship. When they pick me up, we go out drinking. Cheers, bottoms up, Long Island iced tea. My fear now is that everyone knows what I've been up to. My parents are probably gonna kick me out. What's your reaction to that? We had our suspicions. Yeah, but... But we didn't have proof. And you don't really wanna be the alcohol police when you have a daughter 48, you know, you don't want to be the alcohol police. So you're trying to, again, give her the benefit of the doubt. You've been here a few days, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Saturday, she drank alcohol on the plane. She met producers in the office drunk. She requested staff to get her cigarettes. She requested staff accompany her for lunch. She drank alcohol at lunch. On Sunday, she told the staff she had 10 drinks the day before. She told a segment producer she had two shots of tequila and a bottle of wine that morning. Uh, on Monday, she texted the producer at 8 a.m. that she spent her last dollar on alcohol and had been drinking since 2.30 a.m., requested the staff take her to the liquor store. She smelled of alcohol and was stumbling around. You're shaking your head no? <clears throat> we have the text. Yeah. You asked the producer for a drink this morning. We're not going to debate if you have a drinking problem, are we? No. And you disclosed to us that you're drinking in their house. That tells me that you don't really want to hide this. No. Let's let's be completely honest, okay? I mean, what the hell? I mean, they can kill you, but they can't eat you, right? I mean, yeah. How many bottles you figure you've got hidden in your parents' house right now? Empties. Um, maybe like fifteen. And how many have you carried out of there when you had the chance? Twenty. So fifteen there, and you've taken twenty out so far. Yeah. How do you not know this? She's sneaking. She stays in her bedroom with the door shut. I can't help her if you don't help me. Okay. That's the problem here. Well, I can't. we will help you. And, and listen, you, you gotta be just worn the hell out. I mean, cash wise, otherwise, I, and I, I don't know, you, you may not, put him up for husband of the year or whatever, but I'll tell you what, the boy has stepped up here. He's taken care of your children. Yeah. He's, he's bent his life around. He's, he's, uh, uh, God bless you.